Unions in Argentina are pushing for an end to austerity quickly. Less than two weeks ago, they celebrated President Mauricio Macri's loss in a primary vote to center-left candidate Alberto Fernandez. Unions are now pressing for austerity measures to be canceled immediately before presidential elections are held in October. We warn that if workers don't go out to fight, no government will solve the problem for us and therefore we can't wait for months for a hypothetical government. We have to go out today to make our demands. Argentina has been mired in economic crisis, recession episodes, inflation and rising unemployment for two decades. Austerity measures imposed over the past two years since the government took a $57 billion bailout loan from the IMF have pushed more Argentinians into poverty. It's estimated one-third of them are now living below the poverty line. While unions are pushing for government aid, investors are concerned at what could happen if conservative president Macri is replaced by Alberto Fernandez shares a ticket with former president Cristina Fernandez de Kirchner. Since Fernandez won the primary vote, the peso has slumped. It fell by nearly 18 percent last week. Fernandez has tried to reassure markets. Although he's pledging to alleviate austerity, he has ruled out letting Argentina default on its debt.